Hi everybody, this is James Tompkins and welcome to another Understanding Finance Nugget. Now, what I've done so far in some of these other nuggets with time value of money has been related to single cash flow principles. And today we're going to get into multiple cash flow principles. In particular, we're simply going to ask the question, was it an annuity and what is a perpetuity, which are types of multiple cash flows. So with that in mind, you know, this is a definition, so either you know it or you don't. It's not really about understanding if it's a definition. It's about just knowing it, right? So do you happen to know? Well, basically, equal cash flows between equal time periods over a finite period of time. So for example, if we have a cash flow timeline diagram right here, these down here, those represent periods. So this might be a six-month period, in which, and this might be today. It doesn't have to be. It can be whatever you want. So maybe six months from today, you get 100 bucks. Okay? So that's what an annuity looks like. Now, what single word would I have to change in this definition up here to turn it into a perpetuity? Well, maybe you've heard of perpetual motion. What is perpetual motion? It's motion that goes on forever, right? And so perpetuity is basically equal cash flows between equal time periods over a, a finite or infinite, infinite period of time. So here we have, again, equal cash flows. So they're all $100. They're between equal time periods, whatever these time periods happen to be. And it goes on forever. So let me ask you a question. That right there, is that an annuity? Well, some of you might be thinking yes, some of you might be thinking no. So, so here's my question. Was there anything in the definition of the annuity that said when the equal cash flows would begin? There wasn't, right? So yes, this is an annuity. I mean, the fact that there's nothing here implies zero dollars. So this is an annuity that just happens to begin at time three. And similarly, is that right down there? Is that a perpetuity? It's equal cash flows between equal time periods. It goes on forever and happens to start at time two. So is that a perpetuity? Sure, same thing, right? Again, there's nothing in the definition that tells you when it starts. Anyway, so that's what I mean by an annuity and a perpetuity, and I hope this was a good learning experience for you, and I hope to see you in future nuggets. Take care. Bye-bye.